Hey there fellow YouTubers, today I've found a game called Destiny of Thrones, this is a fairly new MOBA, it's free, it's on Android, and it's a really big download, I think the update alone was 160 megs, so I suggest checking it out in this video, seeing if you like it before you download, because it's going to take a long time to download and take up a lot of space on your phone. Master dude, now I've got to pick my character. Tutorial. Alright, let's check First, out the tutorial and find out what we have to do. Alright, so I'm controlling the Monkey King, there's the joystick, there's our abilities, we've got skills, attack, change target, and tap to move. Easy. Please select game control mode. Uh, virtual joystick, I think. Oh no, touch model. Tap on the ground to move your hero. Well done. Let's move forward. You did well. Now let's follow the sign and move forward. Okay, so we can just tap wherever we want to go in this uh, mode. Kill enemies that appear on the Good. front line. Good at the front line. We have an enemy soldier. Just kill it. Click this button to lock on the target. Click this button to attack. Easy. Tap button to switch target. All right, Tap so we just lock on and then we target. attack. Take that. With only little. Great, let's move forward. All right, now we can continue on. Probably shouldn't have done the tutorial. Now, try to kill the enemies using your skills. All right, let's use our skills. Plus. To use the skills, tap and drag the skill to the enemy or target area and right, release awesome. it. By killing more enemies, you are able to learn more skills and enhance the hero's level. Okay, we got loads of skills. There are more enemies approaching. Try to use your skills to kill them. All right, let's use all the skills. So it's wicked. There's a fair few different moves. Yeah, that's a pretty sweet one. Yeah, you can just go through heaps of it. I like that one. That's cool. What else have we got? Oh, I've got to drag them onto the screen. I forgot. Oh, I'm getting done. Gotta wait for all my skills to charge up. They're all red, it doesn't look like they're gonna come back. Well done. Now head back to the base to regenerate. Tap on warp button, your hero. Oh, okay, so you warp yourself to back to get all your power back, I guess. You have earned gold by killing the enemies and it's time to gear up. Recommended equipment will automatically pop all set. Let's go crush right, the so enemy base. Recommended Destroy the enemy's final tower for victory. Okay. So I think we have to take out the opponent's tower as it's a Morva. And uh, we've been playing a few more, heaps of Morvas recently, so I'm starting to understand them better. I just played a free. Uh, Free to play PC one called Paragon. It's on my to let the YouTube channel, and that one's first. pretty cool. Alright, let our army hold the tower, only then we attack. Okay, so if we kick back a bit, the tower attacks the minions, and then we can use our mad skills on the tower without being attacked. Yeah, we got it. Yeah, go, Master Dude. Congratulations. All right, so I finished the tutorial. Let's check out the game. You can now battle with other players, but we would recommend you to complete the advanced tutorial to improve your controlling skills. All right, so there is another tutorial you can do to Please learn more. Steps to begin advanced tutorial. I don't want to do a tutorial. I just want to play. Oh, uh, it's making me do it. Welcome back. Before starting your first battle, let's look at the game features. Tap chat button to communicate with teammates. Hold the chat button. That's pretty cool. Mission. So you can talk to other chat people while you play it. Purchase equipment. Check hero stats or change the game setting. This is the battle map. Slide out to enlarge the map. Awesome. So there's a little map in the corner. Tap this button to minimize the map. Upon level up, you can unlock secondary skills. Hold on skills button to check out skills description. 
When you're at the base, you are able to purchase health potion and mana potion used to generate health and mana during battle. Observer Ward can be purchased at the base. Drag and place it on the ground to see the surrounding area and invisible units. That's all with the game functions. Press next to start the battle. Okay, when enough tutorial. I just want to play. Their base, the battle begins. Get ready for battle. I'm ready. Let's go. Come on, minions. So we're going to look after these minions because they get done by the tower and stuff. And then you can kick back in the background and cause heaps of damage. So there, I better help them out, I guess, a little bit. Alright, can I use any of my skills yet? No, I'm waiting for them to charge. So I'm just going to use my normal attack. So there's heaps of different characters to try out with all different skills and stuff. So there's a fair bit to check out in this game. Oh, I'm getting done. I better kick back. Come on, minions, help us out. Right now, I'm not sure what this one does. Can I drag it over? No. Oh, I'm getting done. So it's best to kick back a little bit so your minions take most of the damage. But I need to uh, charge up my skills so I can start using them. But hopefully if I take out enough dudes, I'll get one of my skills. Oh, I might need to click. Oh, there you go. You click on the little pluses to get them. So, can I drag it onto them? No. Not yet. So I've lost a fair bit of energy. I should need to take it a bit easier. Although I haven't got many minions left. I'm getting hammered now. Ah, get out of there. Really need one of my skills. Why can't I use them yet? I don't understand. Damn, I got no energy. Can I go back and recharge? Warp. I'm warping back to recharge my character. So that way I don't cark it. And there you go, I've got a fair bit of all my energy back. So that was a pretty cool thing to do. Now hopefully I can start using some of my special powers. But so far I'm digging this game. The graphics are pretty cool and uh, it seems to work pretty well. I'll have to check out online against other people to see if it cuts the mustard. Let's get rid of these minions. It's weird, I thought I had to drag these ones onto the screen, but they don't seem to work the same way as they did in the tutorial. Maybe I got it wrong. Whoa, what's he doing? Mega special move. Yeah, take that. Oh, I'm gonna cark it. Oh, First, so that was silly of me because I went too close to the tower. So the tower was taking me out instead of the minions. Alright, so I've bought a few new things, I think, and I've got all these weird potions down the bottom. So I've got lots of new things to try out. And hopefully I can get through past the enemy's tower this time. Attack this guy. Oh, I've gone into the tower zone. That was silly. I need more minions. I swear in the tutorial you drag this stuff on the screen, so I'm really confused about how you use your power-ups. Now I've got a few potions that seem to be healing me, which is helping me heaps. I recommend using that potion I just used. I think it was red. Oh, let's try this green one. Oh, mega mode. Oh, I'm in the tower zone, girl. So he seems to, the character seems to move forward sometimes. I guess I am clicking on that part of the screen, but um, yeah, he seems to want to run by himself sometimes, but I think it's just me. I haven't had the controls that well yet. But hopefully I can get through these dudes. And it is a pretty epic battle. And this uh, character here is really hard to get past. Oof. Oh, see, so I'm going to try and walk back, but you can actually get killed while you're trying to walk. Oh, I got killed while I tried to walk, Joel. 
So you can seem to can click on these bottles down here as much as you want, and then you get them when you're in the game. So I'm not sure why you wouldn't just click on them heaps, because they're cool. So there's a lot I need to learn still in this game, but I'm having fun. There's another pathway I can take around the back here as well. So maybe I'll try it out for something different. Now what's this thing? Is this a pretty or a baby? Alright, now I'm taking on all the minions by myself. Crazy stuff's happening. Well, I can't get in there or the tower will get me. What are these green things? Not sure what they are. I can use my potion to heal myself while I fight. Well, get out of there, dude. I really don't know what this uh, pink thing does. Can I drag it onto someone? It says please choose a target when I try and click it. Oh, that's how you do it. Can I run and get it? Oh, I'm gonna get killed. It was worth it. So some of these special moves must be close range attacks, so when you click on them, uh, it automatically makes you run towards them, which is bad when there's a tower around, because you just get hammered. Uh, I don't think I'm making any progress here. Just start using my normal attack, I think. It's just it doesn't look highlighted, so that's why I never click on the normal attack. Ah, uh, well, I'm level 9, and there is a way to level up your character, so I've got to figure that out as well. How do I level up? Warp, treasure. Anyway, let's just try my normal attack. Oh, okay, I'll just go for this one first. So this one's trying to drive me up towards the tower so I get hammered. Not very really nice. Right, let's take out these minions, they get a bit close. I'm not sure if I like this character. It's really hard to, I don't really know. Sometimes it doesn't seem like he's attacking when I click on attack. Maybe this character only has spells, I'm not sure. I'll definitely try another character in my next game. Don't understand why there's little pluses next to the uh, special weapons either. I can't go in there. Maybe I can try and go and get the tower now. There's a minion in there. Oh, I'm going to get done. Take out my minion tower. Damn, I got done. Well, anyway, I'm going to leave it there. I'll, I'll come back and play it in uh, online and see if it's just as good. But uh, I think it's a pretty good MOBA or MOBA or whatever they're called. And uh, I've still got to get better at them. But uh, it seems like it does all the things fairly well. Uh, I need to obviously learn it better. But for my first playtest, I think it's pretty sweet, and I'm going to give it 4 out of 5. Thanks for watching my first impression, and I'll be back soon. Thanks for watching. Catch you later. Bye.